Hello everyone, this is Ali from Maros Communication. In this video, I'm going to deal with one problem of HP Slimline. This is the problem. Whenever you open your desktop PC of HP Slimline, you will see this blue skin. You can't pass the bootloader menu. Thing is working as you see. I click F2, F9. Nothing is working in this. It is stuck at the bootloader. And this skin is quite familiar with HP Slimline. Let me show you the desktop PC. Here is running on this HP Slimline PC as you see. Let me close this one. I close as you see. I push the power button again. And let the PC start. And as you see. And nothing is working. It's not moving nowhere. It's not opening the PC. Not go to the windows. Not even open the BIOS not even open the system recovery option of F11 nothing is working and of people have this problem okay after researching so much and spending so much time finally I get the solution I hope it will work for all okay let me show the things I check the RAM RAM was okay I check the hard drive it was okay I check the CD DVD driver it was okay everything was okay so where was the problem let me show you okay for this we need to close everything I'm gonna close this one after that connect all the cables after removing all the cables what I'm gonna do now you have to remove three screws let me show you a bit fine here as you see here one two and three this three screw you have to remove from this one after that you can remove this casting you have to remove this clip somehow you have to pull one as you see I am taking one screwdriver and I'm gonna put this little bit force on this clip and here too as you see it's coming out by itself so much easily as you see this side also it has it be different this side as you see this and this you have to do as this and push gentle pressure it should come out as you see awesome it's coming out after that you have to pull this out and slide the DVD driver here is CMOS battery I remove this is not working I remove and change the RAMs is not working either what I find this USB port has the connector directly here to the motherboard all you need to do remove this one gently from the motherboard as you see I take this out we have one more USB connector of this one and that port is going here now connect all the cable back this one of the mouse keyboard and all together I'm putting back all of them the monitor and now I will put the power okay and I go to my skin let let's see what happened now okay I put back this one to inside so I can push the power button now I'll hit the power button is it starting? Let's see. As you see, I'm at the blue skin. And magically, the blue skin is gone. And it's bringing me to some software installation because I have Windows 8 CD. And here is my Windows 8 is opening. As you see, it's working as a charm. It's working great. This is starting the Windows 8. If it's not work for you, you can check back. You can take this USB connector out from here because some of the USB connector they make block the motherboard so motherboard can't boot properly. You 
after here we are my windows 8 is start properly and perfectly okay this is all my friend if you like this video please do subscribe if you have any question leave me as a comment i will try to answer you as much fast as possible as always for more information go to the iris communication www.iriscommunication.com have a nice evening bye